Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to game number two of this best of three. It is the first round of the ESL Pro Series and spawning to the lower left representing Alien Invasion we have CPU. And I need to make this intro quick because to the top right also representing Alien Invasion we've got the blue Protoss player Patience. Now the reason I had to make this quick is because we have got a proxy. That pylon coming down nice and early here for CPU. Going to be very interested to see what comes down from this. Of course, it could be the two gate, although I suspect that it won't be actually, because judging by the timing of it, this is more likely to be a single gate, I believe. Um, and then into a, st a cybernetics core back at home. It's a very popular build at the moment. Of course, we are on Overgrowth, one of the maps that was able to avoid the chop earlier on this season, or in this season actually as a whole, so it's going to be very interesting to see how this goes through. CPU chucks down that one gate, now is he going to prove me wrong and go for the two gates? It definitely is a possibility, but no, is pulling away, that means we should be getting a gas up pretty soon, and just as expected we're going to be going into that one gate, side, uh, one proxy gate pressure coming down from CPU. Patience remember, he's 1-0 up, and being 1-0 up that means that if he wins this, if he holds, He's in a very good position. He'll advance forward and get himself into a good spot. But it looks like Patience himself is going for some sneaky shenanigans. Worth noting that I haven't mentioned this for a while. This is the smiley face map. Look at all the smiley faces. Smiley face. Smiley face. Do you see it? Like there's the eyes. There's the nose. There's the mouth. There's more smiley faces around. They're literally everywhere. Um, I need to find some more now to, to justify my point. Where are they? Yep, there's a smiley face. Smiley face. There's a smiley face. You can see it. You can see it everywhere. Anyway, um, as this is all going, as this is looking pretty good at the moment, um, just want to see. Cybercore coming down. We've got, of course, this proxy pylon. Ooh, okay, this is a bit weird. It's been scouted by Patience, though. This is a double gate with the Cybercore there. So Patience now sees what's coming. CPU's also putting a pylon up on the high ground here. A very, very ballsy move. It's seen by Patience. Patience. Needs to get out some units pretty damn quick. He's waiting to start up that Stalker first. He skipped the Zealot. That could hurt because the Zealot already coming in now for his opponent. Moving up. Busy charging up that ramp. Chrono Boost coming down on that first Stalker. Going to be helpful. Very aggressive play out of CPU at the moment. Patience goes for the surround on the Zealot. Doesn't want to get away. Will sacrifice a couple of probes in order to do this. But wants to be able to try and trap it so that the Stalker and Mothership Core could have dealt with it. Unfortunately, the Zealot does manage to survive. A Stalker now coming up as well. Note there's two Stalkers up against one. Patience is in a very, very tough position as this game continues. He needs to get out a lot more units very quickly. He's down. Oh, CPU is down in the work count at the moment. But of course, he's up in the Stalker count. And that can be all important. Patience pulling probes in order to just buy himself a bit more time. He knows he's got a couple of probes that he can afford to sacrifice. He's now got his own two Stalkers up against two there. This high ground pylon is actually really important, and it's not for warp ins or anything like that, even though, because it's not on the way, it's for the high ground vision, so if the stalkers are here, they could still pick off stuff up on that high ground. Very important, very good decision making by CPU there. Mothership Core needs to back away, gets taken down, that's actually a significant loss because it means there is no photon overcharge. That is critically important because it means that one of the good goals for Patience was to bank up that energy. He was only 12 off when the Mothership Core died, and that could have been very helpful. He wants to also take down this pylon, wants to get rid of that high ground vision so he can really utilize this map to his advantage. But down goes one of the stalkers, down goes the pylon, but CPU, he is up in the stalker count massively at the moment. GG is cooled and that is game number two going to CPU and that is going to force the ace game in this first round of the ESL Pro Series.